Greetings everyone, let's start with today's topic, MS Windows. The topics we are going to cover are built-in accessories, managing files and folder using Windows Explorer, Windows Explorer interface parts. Built-in accessories. Window accessory is a group in which the different types of tools available for different purposes. It is an important part of Windows. It is available in all Windows versions. There are different tools present in this group. Windows operating system ships with some handy applications known as window accessories. Following are some examples of built-in accessories, which are calculator, notepad, paint, explorer, wordpad. Frequently used window accessories. Here are some Frequently used accessories such as calculator, command prompt, internet explorer, notepad, paint, snipping tool, sound recorder, sticky notes. Managing files and folder using Windows Explorer. Windows Explorer is the file management application in Windows. Windows Explorer can be used to navigate your hard drive and display the contents of the folders and subfolders you use to organize your files on your hard drive. Windows Explorer is automatically launched anytime you open a folder in Windows XP. The Windows Explorer interface has several parts to it. The first one, the title bar, shows you the folder you are currently in. You can also set the title bar to display the full path to your folder, that is choose tools, folder options, view and then check the box next to display the full path in the title bar. The path tells you the drivers, folders and subfolders you would have to open to get to this folder, beginning with the root of the drive. Now we'll talk about the menu. This area of the interface includes the menu options you will use while working with your files and folders. One of the menus you will use the most is the view menu. You can use the options listed under this menu to change how the contents your folders are displayed in the main explorer window. The third one is the standard toolbar. This contains buttons that duplicate many of the tasks you can perform using the options in the menu bar. For example, you can click on the Views button to change the display in the main Explorer window. Fourth is the Status bar. The bottom portion of the Explorer window displays information about the folder you have opened such as the number of objects, the number of files and subfolders in that folder, and the size. Fifth is the address bar. Like the title bar, the address bar can be set to display the full path to a folder, that is tools, folder option, view, and then check the box next to display the full path in the address bar. You can enter the path to a folder or subfolder in the address bar and Explorer will open it for you in the main window. 